Activision presents a smashing blast from the past. Developed by vicarious visions. It's Crash Bandicoot! Hello, so in today's video we're going to play Crash Bandicoot Insane Triology. So in this video, okay, I'm going to actually discuss a brief history about Crash Bandicoot because most people, probably the younger generation that are probably maybe 10, 11, 12 years of age, they won't understand, they have not seen this. Now this is, this, these games were actually based on the PS1 games. So, um, if we go into it, we was I will show you. Okay, so, okay, loading. Well, we have Crash Bandicoot One. Okay, Crash Bandicoot One was that wasn't made in uh, ninety six, and Crash Bandicoot Two was made in ninety seven. And Crash Bandicoot 3 Walked was made in 1998. So these games are over 20 years old. So they're nearly vintage, okay? Um, they would have been on the PS1. Now, I actually have uh, Crash Bandicoot Walked for PS1. In another video later on, I'm actually going to show you Crash Bandicoot 3 for the PS1. And I will show you how the graphics will differ. So I'll tell you how I got interested in Crash Bandicoot in the first place, okay? So, years and years ago, myself and my friends, we swapped PS1 games around. And, um, so while that was happening anyway, one of my friends had Crash Bandicoot 2. And, when I played it, I loved the game. So, I decided that um, I was going to actually buy Crash Bandicoot 2. Of course I never got, got Crash Bandicoot 3 because I thought Crash Bandicoot 2 was Crash Bandicoot 3. <laughs> so funny story it ends up with Crash Bandicoot 3. So I still have that game and it still works. And what I'm going to do is um, at a later date uh, I'm going to actually play Crash Bandicoot 3. So, the, so stay tuned to this channel and you'll see Crash Bandicoot 3. I'm also going to do a comparison between Crash Bandicoot in 3 and this game. And Crash Bandicoot 3, the original. Now the original. There, I I first started playing this this new game. Um, uh, there, only a few days ago, and I I already see the differences. And what I'm going to do is, I'm actually going to show you. Now there there's actually no differences. It's just the graphics. So that's actually um, also. It was Sony who had Crash Bandicoot before, but as you see in the start, it's Activision in this. Now, I am going to give you one advice for any marketers or any desk crack or inventors that can do programming software like that. This is actually a good idea and on what to do. Bring back old and games and remake them and into today's graphics. That that would bring actually the older generation of gamers like myself back into the the gaming system because uh, I don't play much PlayStation myself no uh, to be mainly PS1 games and PS2 games that I played like you know I have a few PS3 games but you know kind of got a bit too old, but um, I seen this game and I had to buy it and my brother bought it <laughs> but he bought it and he showed it to me I was amazed and it was a great game 
But um, yeah, so I'm going to go right into it now, and I am going to play uh, Crash Two. Since uh, Crash Two was the game that I liked, so I'm going to play it now. By the way, this is actually how the startings begin in the, the PS1 games as well. Just to let you know that. Crash is looking bored, so I better go. When you click the apples, when you click the hundred apples here, um, you get a knife, a life. There's the armadillos. That's kind of what I remember the Crash 2 to be anyway, the armadillos and the big holes and the fucking game like, and the boxes. With this one you have to be very careful on how you get the apples. Fuck you! Yeah. Right. I will take the crystals. What do you just crash cash? This is the one I remember the most, this one here. It's no one go for some reason. So I just want to play this one.
That's our finished up, boys.